Maine's Labor Department has been under fire from people who have had their claims canceled for being fraudulent when they're not. Today, Labor Commissioner Laura Fortman and Deputy Commissioner Kimberly Smith briefed legislators on the situation, showing graphs of two spikes in initial unemployment claims, one in early April, another in mid-May, and that led them to suspect fraud. Fortman says her office has received 162,000 initial claims for unemployment assistance and has processed 82% of them to date. It's paid out $882 million in benefits since the pandemic began. But Fortman says her employees are also looking for red flags in that sea of claims. And they have canceled 23,000 claims they suspect of being fraudulent. Now, there are ways for people to get their legitimate claim that was maybe canceled to be reconsidered, but today Fortman acknowledged that it's been very difficult for some. The stories that we hear from individuals whose claims are being impacted by this are heart-wrenching, and uh, we take that very seriously, and we do everything humanly possible to expedite uh, these claims and reinstate them. We also know, as the deputy commissioner pointed out, that we had received 24,000 complaints from Maine people saying that their identity was being used fraudulently. Now, Deputy Commissioner Smith says so far 9,700 of those canceled claims have now been investigated and reinstated.